Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to the next episode of the Popular Fiction Challenge. And in last week's episode, Montana, Monta I keep calling him Montana, his name's Harrison. Maybe I should have called him Montana Harrison, I don't know. But Harrison, he had mysterious woohoo with, um, with Liberty because we saw her leave the plot and I was going to get him to call her back so they could chat and stuff and then it said I couldn't get her to come back because she w it wasn't appearing you know to give her the hangout at, ple at the current lot and then he had woohoo with an empty space in the bed so not quite sure what happened there but um, let's give you the residence keys although I'm pretty sure I did that already and can we get you to stay the night? More choices, friendly. As ask to move in. Should we ask her to move in? Because I mean, this is The Sims. They're not uh, they're not known for moving slowly. Let's ask her to move in. And then we'll have someone else in the house because he has to have a human child so we might as well get started on that as soon as possible and we need to meet vampires so we did create that no 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 oh god okay i guess I, she's not supposed to move in not today but in the last episode we created a vampire club we created a dating club and liberty was clear leader so I think we're going to settle with Liberty and also we created a vampire club and so far it's only Lilith, Lilith Caleb and Vlad, Vladislaus, Vladislaus, right, who are part of this club and I'm pretty sure if we have a club gathering now Oh, they're all on their way because they're all vampires, so they don't sleep. Which is cool. What book is that in the corner? Is that the vampire tome? Yes, it is. Um, put in inventory. We have a... Okay. So, to become a master vampire, he needs to participate in vampire training. And right now, both Caleb and... Um, actually Caleb, his sister Lilith, and Vladislaus, wherever he is, oh there he is, they are all more superior, so they can all train him, vampire, request training. And what's the other thing he has to do? Become a minor vampire. Uh, really? That's, I've never seen any sims do that. Wow, that was vampiric training. All right, and how does he how does he do the whole minor vampire thing? All right. Um, what did I say they do in their club? I can't remember. Um, just use vampire powers. Okay, can we ask for? Can we spar? Yeah, you can get training from all three of them. And... More choices, vampire, request training. Can you spar with anybody or not yet? Drink plasma, no. Um... More choices. I'm pretty sure... Oh yeah. Spar with Caleb. I don't think... I think you can get points from that. I'm not 100%. But Caleb's probably going to kick his... Okay, just stand there. Yeah. We knew Caleb was going to kick his butt because Caleb's a stronger vampire than he is. Um, let's see if we can do some more training. Not training, sparring. I think he'll have to uh, be stronger in his vampiric powers in order to 
ill to beat another vampire. Why are you reacting like that? You're not that bothered. You're a vampire. Okay, what's he uncomfortable with? Oh, he needs to feed. Do we not have any plasma? Oh, we have plasma. Yep, Caleb's mopping the floor with him, but that's to be expected. That is to be expected. And we've got two power points to use. You see, detect personality, fly as a bat, cast hallucination, eternally welcome. I think fly as a bat, we'll take those. Alright, we need two more power points. Um, we are, oh, you're going to drink plasma. And I think you need to have dark meditation. And let's end the gathering and let's get you off to sleep because you've got work in like two hours. Yeah. Because you're a doctor, you need, you need a bit of sleep. But no, I think we can do that on some nights. Alright, sleep. You're not going to need much sleep because you're pretty much energised from um, dark meditation. Did that give us any more vampire points? Oh no, wrong thing. Did that give us any... No, it didn't give us any more points. But I think we were closer. Right, what do we need to do for work? Treat two patients. Okay. Is it time for work? Oh no, you're just energised. Are you in your dark form? I think... No, you're not. You're in your normal form, I think. Always move as a bat, because that is just awesome. But we, I think we need to invite Liberty to move in. And then the sooner we start on getting a child, the better. Because we need a human child for the next generation. Okay, he's in, oh, he's feeling insecure. I do have the Slice of Life mod installed. It's by um, Kawaii Stacy, I believe it is. And it adds a few more um, traits, not traits, but um, I forget what the word is. It gives you a couple more options at the bottom. So you have different things that happen to your sim. Let's join him. So you'll get your sim feeling insecure or feeling very happy. It also adds a memory system. It um, Your sim can get drunk from drinking juice, which is quite funny. And um, there's other things as well. So if you want to install it, you can always Google Kawaii Stacy and have a look for yourself. Okay, in you go, Harrison. You should be... Oh, why are you... You're focused from being a genius. And you're not burning up in the sun. Alright, that's fine. Okay, swab a patient, greet three patients, and transfer a patient case. Okay, let's swab you. Um, examine patients. Swab for sample. You have to do... And I think greet, greeting patient, that's got to be at the front desk. We're going to have to zoom up for this. Okay, he didn't get the sample. And always moving as a bat is kind of annoying. Uh, Alright, Harrison, vampire, disable always move as a bat. Not while you're at work. Because that's really annoying. Alright, let's examine. Oh, he's already been transfer patient case. We can do that. Because that's one of the things we've been tasked to do. Uh, transfer to Kayan. Okay, check a patient's ears. 
let's swab Clara again. Swab the sample and check her ears. Uh, you haven't done it either? Oh. And Clara has nothing between her ears. Alright, let's try take, and we'll take her temperature as well. Take temperature. No, don't do that. Swap for sample. Third time's the charm. Third time is always the charm. No? Really? Leave the trash. Harrison, leave the trash. I'm going to get you to keep swabbing until you get there. Because we are going to swab for some. Oh, we got it. Oh, we got two swab. Two, uh, the two samples. Um, what are you? What, have, what are you going to wash your hands? Okay, cool. Um, okay. Analyze the patient sample. We can use one of those. Analyze patient sample, and greet three patients. Um, admit and admit you, and admit you. That's three people to admit. I'm guessing that's what they mean by greet the patients. Eh, maybe not. Well, we'll see if it if it makes it do that or not. No, that didn't work. Okay. Friendly? No? Okay. Friendly? Friendly introduction. Maybe that's what they want. Yeah, thanks for seizing all over me, mister. Because, you know, that's what you do. You just sneeze all over the doctor. And that'll be fine. I hope, ha I hope Harrison doesn't get sick. Okay, last person. Greet him. Right, we got that done. Uh, deliver medication. And log sample analysis results. So... Let's log the results. Examine patient. Didn't we transfer the case already? But obviously that didn't work. Uh, deliver medication. Let's examine patient. Um, click on a sim. Well, he's been diagnosed. No, we don't want to. That require and select treat with medication. More choices. Treat patient. Okay, that's the only thing we can give him. All right, give him medication. Right, examine her eyes. Does that deliver medication? Yes, awesome. So check her eyes. Hopefully you will talk to her while you're checking her eyes. Uh, oh. 
Okay, don't poke her eye out, Harrison. Alright, check her ears. Ears, ears. No, 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 no. You don't have time to do that. And friendly. Ask a... Oh, no. That... Well, that's from... That's from the Slice of Life mod. There you go. Um, examine patient, swab for sample. Hopefully it works better on her than it did on her mother. Nope. And take her temperature. There you go. And you can transfer her case. Examine patient, transfer patient case to... Dr. Megan. Um, what are you going? Okay. Okay, you can discuss general health. I know. Um, examine patient, discuss general health with her mother. Yeah, something's going around if Elsa and her mother are both in hospital. Hopefully, whatever they have, it's not contagious. Okay, let's go find a mod, a puddle to mop up. There's always puddles in this place. Mop that up. And... Analyze patient sample. Elsa is the little girl, right? Yeah. Alright, we'll get him to stay late. And let's run through this. Okay, no more puddles. You're not staying late to mop up all the puddles. That's what that's what the um the cleaning staff are there for. Okay, so we've got you analyzing. Oh, Okay, and all right, get off the computer. He needs to research health reports online. Okay, how many minutes do we have left? Oh, we've got an hour and a half. That's fine. Deliver medication to a patient. Um, examine patient, no. Alright, let's... Discuss general health, no. Do we not have anyone else? Okay, well then let's admit you to a bed. And admit somebody else. And then we can see what else we can do. Okay, let us... Alright, don't admit him. Alright, let's check your ears. And let's swab for a sample. Hopefully, with all the swabbing you've been doing today, you can actually get it done. What is it with these sims and nothing between their ears? And... Check eyes. Uh-huh. No. Discuss general health. Let's do that. We can do that. And let's transfer his case. And let's give you to Dr. Megan. Can we take his temperature? That's the last thing we, we need to do. No? Yes? No. Oh, good. 
Well, now he's burning in the sun. Quick, run! No, you're not running. Okay, now we've got you in. Let's invite Liberty over. Actually, drink a plasma. Good boy. And you can invite Liberty over. Where is Liberty? Uh, invite to hang out at current lot. Okay, we've got that sorted. She's going to come over and we'll ask her to move in. Hopefully she won't reject us. Do they, do Sims reject you and you ask them to move in? I don't know. Yeah, um, here comes Liberty. I thought, um, well, no, I would have thought that if they've got a key, they will just walk in. If she moves in, I'm going to change her walk style. I really hate the goofy walk style. I just don't like it. Um, friendly, more choices, ask to move in. Oh, okay. Autonomous kiss. That's nice. Yes. Now we could move in all three of them and then move the other two back out and get the money, but we're not going to do that. That would be an easy way to get money. We're not going to do that. We just move in Liberty and we make sure she has a job. All right, Montana, back in. Harrison. Harrison, go in before you burn. I mean, I know you like Liberty and I know you think she's special, but inside. Liberty, you're late for work. Go to work. Oh, you should have gone to work like six hours ago. What does she work as? She is... Oh, she's an astronaut. Okay. Right, so now we've got that. How good of a friend is Liberty? She's a friend. We need to add on an extra bedroom. Hmm. I don't know how we're going to get this done. Alright, let's do a quick fix. Let's bring this across. And then, if we get a single bed... Uh, let me see, what's the best? Oh, I like that one. Um, and what's that? Oh, that's from, um, it's pretty pricey though. I'm guessing the double bed is going to be just as pricey. Because I did go on a bit of a downloading spree. And downloaded lots of furniture. Do I have a double bed that's CC? That's from the min min Minimalist. Try saying that with your mouth full. Uh, filter items. Content. Custom content. So that's the... Oh, there it is. It's 3,000. If we sell that... Oh, we still don't have enough. Okay. Alright, well you get back your bed. Liberty gets the really nice bed. You will get a really nice bed. Or maybe we should get... Well, then again, he doesn't really need it because he has bam vampiric energy dark meditation okay let's see 
we need hmm do we have a club gathering what time does liberty finish work i think she finishes at seven. Oh, she's at work till nine we could have a club oh she's in knights of the hedge okay we could have a club gathering and then and then Harrison could drink from uh no I didn't want her to skip work why did it want her to skip work I didn't say anything about skipping work what's the next thing he has to do become a minor vampire although I hmm if he likes humans he's not really gonna drink from them so I think what we're gonna have to do does this count as part of our lot I keep meaning to check no it's not and it's not is it night time if we go here are you going to burn we're just doing this for science just for an experiment Harrison are you burning no you're not burning can we can we fish anywhere it was turning into a into a cog but it's not anymore okay I don't think we could actually oh you know what in Brindleton Bay there's a stall I wonder if you can buy fish there okay was it there I think it was um buy pet food no all the food no oh it, that might have been what I saw but um you can't actually buy fish I thought you could well that's a pain or maybe it was this one well let's bring Liberty over anyway oh she's here oh well they these two are obviously moving in the right direction okay I thought she was at home I didn't know she'd come here obviously uh, move out the way lady please thank you obviously they like each other more than okay well I don't have to do anything they're just getting on with it which is awesome because that saves me a bit of a job can you more choices no that's on yourself uh who are you lady why are you muscling in on the conference oh, oh it's Wanda okay she knows them. And who are you that you got all upset? I don't know who you are. Well, I did say I was going to change Liberty's walk style. Let's do that quickly. Because I can do that from the MC Command Center, which is the other mod that I have installed. I can't live without the MC Command Center. So... Let's change her walk. Tough? No. Feminine. Swagger? No. Yeah, Liberty does strike me as a very bouncy person. Yeah. And while we're here... We might just uh, turn around. Let's just quickly check her outfits. 
All right, that's every day. Let's get rid of the hat. Let's give you a very quick makeover. Get rid of the glasses. Did I get rid of something else? Oh no. The hat. The glasses. Let's change your hair because... Uh, do I have some nice CC hair she could use? I kind of like that. Oh, that is a bit kind of... That is a lot. I like that for her. That's nice, but it's got a weird shine on it. I can't remember where I picked that up. Um... Oh, I like that. Did she always have black hair? I'm pretty sure she had brown hair. She had brown hair. Right, I like that. Um, the top I don't mind, the trousers I do mind. I like that skirt on you. That's a nice skirt. And let's give you proper shoes. Flip flops are not shoes. Although to be honest, I can see Liberty as a trainer wearing person yeah she does strike me as a trainer wearing person all right formal that's which hairstyle all right if we look for cc hairstyle unless of course it wasn't marked as formal content custom content because sometimes you'll find that um, some styles are not marked as what they're supposed to be. So let's get rid of those glasses. Oh my god, the makeup. But we're going to leave it. Or we could just change your dress. Um, this is a very quick down and dirty. Yeah, that's better give you blue shoes as well do those shoes come in blue yeah I'm gonna have to change your hair for everything aren't I get rid of the glasses get rid of the hat change the hair and the rest of it is fine Um, see that's what I mean about custom content the trainers they've got them as the main but not under athletic where you'd think they'd have them sleep let's change your hair that's what we want and scroll down we want that we might as well change them all while we're here it kept for that hot weather it kept for that so why all of a sudden it kept for everything else it's a bit random mm. I don't know why they love to put sunglasses on everybody all right clothes that's every day Formal, athletic, sleepwear, party. Actually, that party outfit's not too bad. Uh, swimsuit, yeah. Hot weather, just get rid of the hat. And actually, that's not too bad. And cold weather, the hat. Actually, do they have... What hats do they have for cold weather? Do they have any bobble hats? Or actually that one. Yeah, that's fine. 
There you go. Um, oh, you're wearing that for work. Okay, let's do one last thing. Romance. Um, exchange numbers. I don't know why they always have the exchange numbers option, even when they know each other. It's like they live together. They should have each other's number. Is that going to work? Liberty? Okay, you like that. Uh, more choices, romance. Ask if single. Yep, she's single. Good, good. Although we knew that anyway. Uh, romance. Flirt. <laughs> <laughs> yep, Liberty likes him. Okay, this is going good. Uh, whisper sweet nothings. Can we do that? Is Liberty going to be responsive? If we do that? <laughs> yes, Liberty has moved next to him. No? No? Okay, you didn't want to whisper sweet nothings. Uh, okay, that didn't happen. Anyway, right. Is he embarrassed by that? I think he is. Yeah. Can you, um... Apologize? Something? Something? No? No. Okay. All right, you, um, more choices, actions. Can he invite her back to his place? Although technically they live together. Who are you talking to? Harrison, leave the other woman. Um, action. Oh. I think that was about to pop up. There's me being a bit too impatient. Okay, Liberty. Um, Liberty was invited. Oh, there you go. And let's go back home. Where are we? Where are we living? Win Windenburg. For a second, I couldn't remember. And let's go home. Okay, I think this is a good point to go to sleep. Oh, they're both embarrassed. Okay, we will remedy that in the next episode. Okay, so this episode we got Liberty and Harrison together. They're living in the same house. They probably could sleep in the same bed. I'm not sure if they would though. Oh, we have another vampire. Great. Ira Shirin Shiriniv Shir Oh, I can't even pronounce that. So we have another member. But yes, so Liberty and Harrison are living together, but we're going to have to work on their romance so that, you know, we can get started on the next generation. And Harrison isn't, he hasn't been, um, hasn't been promoted at work, but he's doing well. He had to treat two patients. He only treated one. I'm sure you treated two. Okay, cure a patient's illness by giving them... Okay. So we have to actually give them medicine. So hopefully we'll be able to do that next time. 
Are you angry? No, she's not angry. Okay, she's not angry. Okay, that's cool. So next time we will work on um, Harrison. I really want to call him Montana. <laughs> we will work on Harrison's... Um, I've lost my train of thought. We'll work on his performance. Get him promoted at work. Because we need him to max out the doctor career. And, I mean, if he's going to keep going at this rate, he's never going to do it. But we need to get that done. So, thanks very much for watching. I hope you will like, comment, and or subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel. And I will see you in the next episode. Okay, bye-bye.